Hi everybody, it's Faith from Fireside and Tarot. I hope everyone is well. Still knocking out the special series event. Who's coming back to haunt you this Mercury Retrograde? <laughs> In honor of Halloween and Mercury Retrograde. Last one of 2020. I don't know about you, but I'm pretty excited. <laughs> I just didn't get this done and over with. All right, but we're having fun with it, which is what you're supposed to do. All right, let's see who we're reading. Virgo. Hmm. Oh, okay. Somebody's knocking at the door. Hold on. Okay, sorry about that. I dealt with the person at the door and then my phone rang, so I had to deal with that. Okay, where are we? Virgo. This reading will be for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for the last Mercury retrograde of 2020. If it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to do whatever you choose to do. The message given by the cards, if you choose to do anything at all, it's your journey. I might have to read the cards. If it doesn't resonate, leave the cards on the table and walk away. It's just not your reading. It's just not your message. If you want something that might resonate a little bit better, check your other placements. Your moon, your rising, your Venus. As always, time and energy both fluid. All things can and maybe vice versa. And play out from the perspective of a cross watcher. And we all know how I feel about the cross watchers. You're always welcome here. However, this is an 18 and only, 18 and older only channel. Please. So if you're under the age of 18, I encourage you to click off now. Come hit me up on your 18th birthday. I'll do a free reading for you. Because, yeah. I just assume not get hate mail from somebody's mom or dad. Thank you very much. Okay. Virgo. Who's coming back to haunt you? Five of Ghosts reverse. This is somebody you've gotten over. You're out of the state of sadness about it, or it didn't make you that sad to begin with. What happened? The magician. This was a manipulative person. They knew how to pull strings. We'll put it that way. Could have been an Aries, could have been a water sign. What's going on with this person now? <laughs> Page of pumpkins. Oh, really? Oh, really? Oh, really? They could possibly be feeling a little bit apologetic about the situation. Possibly. We'll get a clarifier on that in a second. Why are they coming back? The night of ghosts reversed. Yeah, we're going to need to clarify that. This may be someone who wants to come back to stay. I don't like that magician reversed. And you're not all that sad about it anyway. So, how do you feel about it? Queen of Bats. <laughs> Queen of Bats reversed. Oh, usually, I, oh, I'm just going to keep rolling. Usually, I clarify at this point and then, but... Just give it a second. What do you think about it? So you have a bad attitude toward them, but the return would be welcome. I'm hearing you want to smell sweet victory, Virgo. I'm hearing you want to smell that sweet smell of victory. Before we find out what you're going to do about it, I'm going to clarify these cards. This isn't like you. 
The universe supports its spirit. Gotta get some clarity in the cards on the table for Virgo. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for this last retrograde of 2020. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Hmm. Well, that's interesting, isn't it? Hmm. Hmm. One more shuffle and we'll have it. So you're not sad about it. You know this was a manipulative person. They may be feeling a little bit apologetic. Okay, fine. Okay, fine. One more. I can't count today. I have a migraine. You Okay. Really? Oh my gosh. Stop. Stop. Five of rods reversed. You... You're just glad to not be fighting with this person anymore by the looks of things. Stop. Page of rods. You may still hold a candle for them. Again, could be a fire sign you're dealing with. There's a whole lot of fire on this board right now. Why is the magician reversed here? Knight of Rods reversed. Hmm. Okay. Possibly a manipulative person, but possibly it just never got off the ground. Because the... Seven of Rods reversed. Ace of Pentacles. It never got off the ground. The seed was planted, but it never got off the ground. There was confusion. Possibly someone had an internal struggle going on. Hmm. Okay. You want to talk. Queen of Elixirs reversed. Someone could have had mixed emotions about the situation. Possibly could have been a little bit emotionally withdrawn. Okay, why is the page pumpkins here? Three of Cups. Oh, well, mm. one more. Mm. Four of Cups reversed. Mm. Person may be coming to the realization that. They want to reunite with you. They want to reconnect with you. Maybe they realize that they could have ignored a cup in the past or spent so much time concentrating on things that happened in the past that they didn't see the cup that was being handed to them. The seed was planted. It, it, it grew slowly. Somebody was emotionally withdrawn, had some internal struggles going on. It just didn't get up off the ground. Okay. Okay. Well, okay. Why is the night a ghost reversed here?
dinosaur hordes. <laughs> we know who, now we know why. They're a little obsessed. This might be keeping them up at night and wanting to reconnect with you. They could be afraid that that cup was dumped for good. Two of Swords reversed. They're, they're mulling over this right now. They're having a hard time deciding if they want to approach you, I think. One more. Three of Swords. Oh, this breaks their heart. Sad. Hmm. Who? You're not sad about it. Someone you hold a, a torch for still. Okay, so. If there was arguing or fighting, it's it's pretty well for stopped. If there was confrontational energy. All right, why is the Queen of Bats here? Why have such a bad attitude toward it? So, how you feel about it? You're open to communication, but with this tower card, you just you have this vibe that it's just gonna fall apart again. Okay, Virgo. So why is the Six of Imps here? Six of Rods. Six of Rods upright, Six of Rods reversed. What you think of it. Sweet smell of victory. Return not welcome. One more. Five of Cups reversed. You've come out of your state of sadness about this. I don't think you want any part of this. Because you still have a bad attitude toward it. One more. Hi. Wheel of Fortune in the upright. You've done ended this cycle. You have closed it out. You're done. Okay, so what you gonna do about it? Queen of Wands. She's very intuitive, she's very fiery, she's very passionate, she knows what she wants and she goes after it. Okay, and she also knows what she doesn't want. Can I get one for the Queen of Imps? <sighs> it 
Ten of Cups reversed. The Fool. The Five of Swords reversed. You're leaving the pieces on the ground. You're leaving the cups kicked over. You're going off, starting new adventures, new things with new people. You're leaving it. Okay. Well, that's your right to do so, Virgo. I'm not going to fault you for that. It. I'm having a sense that it may have been just a misunderstanding. But for whatever reason, you ain't having it. I don't know if I want to delve into this any deeper. And maybe you saw them as a manipulative person. Maybe they were manipulative. They're apologetic. They, they, they want to come back. They want to come back and stay, but you just ain't having it. I think they've mulled over how bad they hurt you. I think possibly they've mulled over how they kicked your cup over and how they broke your heart. And they're afraid to approach you. I would be too. Well, Virgo, it's up to you. I'm going to get your advice and we're going to call it a read. Eight of imps and the fool. Keep trucking forward. New things, new places, new paths. Keep on walking. Two off of this one. Hmm, the world in the reverse in the page of coins. Hold on. Six of coins reversed, ten of coins reversed, world reversed, page of coins, a page of coins in the upright, page of pumpkins. If you choose to repeat this cycle and not allow the cycle to just come to a close and accept their apology, you may want to prepare yourself for things to be just as unequal and unabundant as they were the first time around. So, that's just what I'm seeing in the cards. It's up to you what you do. It's your journey, not mine. Just be aware. It's going to be the merry-go-round. Okay? That's what the cards are telling me. Be blessed. Have fun this Mercury retrograde. And Take care of yourself. Take care of each other. I appreciate you. Thanks for stopping by. And I'll catch you next time, Virgo.